Hi folks and thanks for joining. Here's a quick look at my prototype simple AM radio transmitter. Again, this comes to you from a known schematic just with a few modifications. There's the uh, loop stick antenna. Uh, you can see I went with that in addition to a small plastic variable capacitor in lieu of the uh, larger metal uh, capacitor itself just to be able to get this thing to fit inside of a uh, pill bottle that I already had on hand left over from my uh, signal tracer design. Underneath look at the uh, circuit board you'll see some areas uh, colored green with a marker that just denotes where my uh, antenna leads themselves come out in addition to some future tie-in points. You can see a little uh, hot wax was used to secure the uh, loop antenna as well as the uh, tuning condenser. In addition, of course, it's soldered in to the um, board itself. The uh, transistors themselves, the NTE-102A, the last to uh, go in. And uh, just for me, because I don't work with transistors a lot, it's confusing. You can see I've marked my leads accordingly. Uh, the red being emitter, base uh, in green, and the collector I left uh, unmarked. And here I've got things uh, soldered back in place. A piece of silicone placed here just to uh, protect the back side of the board from the battery. And as well as I think I threw some tape here on the uh, side of the battery as well just to ensure I didn't have a, uh, a short. A little hole drilled there for the uh, power on off switch. And you can see I decided to uh, loop my whole audio input cable through a grommet and uh, just a very simplistic design itself. The uh, vertical height here uh, roughly 60 uh, millimeters high and around 45 to 50 millimeters wide so very small. Let's take the uh, little transmitter here, a spin, and uh, you can see here we're going to tuned in on the uh, low band. And it seems to me it works best in the uh, lower part of the spectrum. Around uh, 540 or so, that's a dead spot for me here in my market. And uh, here you can see I'm going to just spin the dial here. We'll go up to uh, roughly 1600. I think this dial on this little transistor radio is a little off. Uh, but you can see me retuning here and uh, it seems to uh, work pretty well. There's some harmonics I noticed on the transmitter also. So you'll uh, have to uh, kind of work with that if you decide to uh, build one of these based off of my modifications in the uh, design. Look at the description of the video. I'll put a link to the author of the uh, schematic and I'll also note my uh, changes as well. Thanks for viewing.